You ever wonder how trading systems communicate behind the scenes? Whether you're troubleshooting, building, or just curious, the Fix Protocol is the secret sauce of global finance. Stick around. I'm breaking down the must-know fix tags that power trading in less time than it takes to grab a coffee. 35 equals D, 35 equals A. 35 equals D, new order single. 35 equals eight, execution report, fundamental tags in trading. These are your orders, and these are the responses to the orders, the executions, the fills, the moolah. So when I'm looking at a fix message, one of the key things I wanna know about the message is what is the message type? And to find that out, I look for tag 35. 35 means message type. It contains a value which specifies the message type. D means new order single. This is a new order. Eight means execution report. These are the responses to the orders. When you order those new fuzzy slippers on Amazon and your order gets rejected because you're over your credit card limit, it's gonna come back in the form of a execution report as an analogy, of course. Maybe you ordered three slippers and you only got two. That's a partial fill. You're gonna get that information from your execution report. Now let's dive into the required tags. So with every 35 equals D message, just like every other fixed message, there are required tags that have to be in the message. Otherwise, you're gonna get a session reject, 35 equals three. For an order, you need tag 11, client order ID, you need tag 55 for symbol, you need 54 for side, you need 38 for quantity, you need 40 for order type, and you need 59 for time and force. Client order ID, unique identifier for the order. 55 symbol, let's say we're trying to buy IBM. 54 side, buy or sell. One is buy, two is sell. 38 equals, how many slippers do you want? 100, sure. Quantity, 38. 40 is order type, market or limit. You wanna get the market price, whatever it's currently selling for, or do you wanna do, I wanna pay this price or better? Time and force, how long is the order gonna be valid for? Most orders are probably gonna be day orders. They're only valid for the day. At the end of the trading day, the order essentially expires. Now let's talk about 35 equals eight, execution, report. Tag 11, client order ID. Tag 17, exec ID. 150, exec type. 39, status. Then we have last shares and last price. So 11 identifies the order, 17, identifies the specific execution in the same way that the client order ID uniquely identifies the order. Then you have the status of the order, whether it's new, partially filled or filled, how many shares were just executed, what was the last price. Let's also talk about the big G, cancel replace, and the A and the five, log on, log off. And of course, drop that zero and get with the hero, 35 equals zero, heartbeat. So cancel replaces to modify the order. I wanna change the details of the order. I use a 35 equals G message. To start a fixed session, I send a log on message, an A. At the end of the day, I send a five, log out. And when there's no activity, business must be slow. You have heartbeats, 35 equals zero. And with that, I'm gonna go ahead and log off. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on the like button, subscribe, and smash that bell.